Well, it was nice to not have a rumored, confirmed release date for a trailer for at least 48 hours while Loki took over the internet. But don't worry, this time it's coming at... Um, Monday, January... January? Monday, July 5th. So why are people convinced that now, and that the next official reveal, and this one is definitely correct, according to people, is July 5th? Well, if we do some math and we look at the good old pattern of Spider-Man releases, typically, Spider-Man lines up with the 4th of July. Hence why there's always the scene of him like with the American flag and everything and they try to get it into that time frame and typically yeah this is exactly when you release a Spider-Man film. So I think people are starting to expect that hey since this year we can't have it and it should have been out you know um, at this point what a year ago the original July release date that maybe just maybe now they're going to release it. As a sort of, hey, look, you still get Spider-Man around the 4th of July. Here's the flag that's in the trailer. You know how this goes. Everybody knows those scenes in the Spider-Man movies. They're very much just synonymous with him in New York now. And, um... Look, I don't... <laughs> uh, I don't know how many more times I can break people's hearts. Uh, I just don't see the point of it. Like, this entire film... Hell, I would say everything Sony's done with marketing, every single film they have coming out now has been unorthodox and out of character for them. Does it make sense to drop a Spider-Man trailer around the 4th of July? Of course it does. It would be genius. Literally, it'd be like the thing that takes over the weekend along with 4th of July and freedom and America everywhere. It's, it, it's The synergy is there, but Sony just doesn't seem to care about synergy anymore at all like they had the opportunity on ghostbusters day to do something big with the ghostbusters for the new film what did they do barely anything they just don't care i think they're taking a cue from the other studios and going how about we'll do it when we're set and not beforehand and i think a part of this is also them being apprehensive because of you know you never know what the future holds because there's still plenty of places around the world that are not, in fact, open up. I mean, I talk to a ton of you guys that are fans that are from Australia. You guys are struggling over there. So, maybe they're still being reactionary. And I think that could play into it. If I was Sony, I would release a teaser or maybe a poster of all three Spider-Men or something. But this is Sony, so I'm not expecting anything. And if I get anything, anything at all, I will be happy. But... Just don't go into this weekend, the 4th and 5th specifically, looking for it because you might be disappointed if you build up all your hype. I mean, how many YouTubers have streamed a live reaction coming at every Monday at 9am because they anticipated and then the stream is just disappointed? Way too many. <laughs>